families. So good to see you here again for our Easter mainly music online together. I'm looking forward to seeing you in person next term. This is our very last session for term one and yeah I'm hoping to be back in person for term two so I'll see you then. <laughs> I've got my baby here this morning, you've got yours and we've got all our things on the shelf celebrating and representing Easter for us this morning. Shall we start with our tēnā koe and get right into it? of the song and do the actions on our bubbers. Here we go. Are you standing? Are you standing? Now move your hands to the music. We can move our hands, we can move it over baby. We can move baby's hands. Move your hips from side to side. Move our hips together. Blink your eyes. Blink your eyes. Good blinking. Move your knees up to your tummy. You take your knees and bring them up to the tummy. Knees up. Pat your head with both hands. Jump and jump and jump. Jump and get you some jumping! Roll your shoulders all around. You can just touch baby's shoulders, give them a massage. With your elbow. With your elbow. Rub your wrists. Hold your baby's wrists gently. Give them a nice rub. Fingers in and fingers oh, out. And you can do this over them, or you can gently touch their fingers. Rock your body front and back. Now it's time to sit down. <laughs> Good, sitting down. All right, we can stay sitting and I'm going to do a rhyme about some Easter eggs. On the shelf here I've got some Easter eggs, some different ones. Look at the different sizes. So we can teach Baba even from a young age different sizes, things that's feel different and look different and are bigger or smaller and use our language with them. So we go here is a little egg. 
Can you show them something a little? Here is a medium sized egg. Ooh, but bigger. And here is a big Easter egg. Shall we count them? Now we can do some counting with our bubbers. One, two, three. Tahi, hua, toru. One, two, three. Good counting. They got some cool patterns and things on there. And you can do things with your baby's toy, showing them different colours, bright colours, and see how their eyes adjust and, and they take in all those cool things. Alright, put them back on the shelf and I'm going to come over here because I have a T Maharo Tamanu. Uh, this is a Sharon Holt Tero sing-along book and it's all about New Zealand birds. So we're going to have a listen and a read about the different birds and how they're amazing. children but you are too you are all doing an amazing job being parents so well done <laughs> okay now the other thing we can do with some of our 
Tamaraki, our little peppy, is get something. These were in our email that you might have been able to print out. They're little frogs to so do five little speckled frogs. Or if you were unable to print them out, just because you might not have a printer, not everyone does, just use some of their toys, or you could draw them on a piece of paper yourself. And we're going to do five little speckled frogs. I'm going to jump into the water. Five little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool, where it was nice and cool. Now there are four green speckled frogs. Only four speckled frogs now. Four little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are three green speckled frogs. Tahi hua turu. Three little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped Bye -bye. into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are two green speckled frogs. Two little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum! One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there is one green speckled frog, which is Tappy. We only got one left. One little speckled frog sat on a speckled log. Eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. He jumped into the pool. Bye bye. It was nice and cool. Now there are no green speckled frogs. Oh, all gone. All our froggies are gone. They've all gone into the water. Must be a hot day and they're cooling off. <laughs> Alright, if you have, we're going to come back up here and stand up. What we need is a scarf. Do you have a scarf or some piece of fabric that you might be able to use? I'm going to use my scarf over here from my shelf, my green one. We're going to do skinnamarinky and we can do this over the baba and they can just touch it. We can have it over their faces, something for them to look at. Here comes my baby. Oh, if I could back up off the ground. Hey. We're going to do skinnamarinky, I love you. Skinny my rinky dinky dink, skinny my rinky do. I love you. Skinny my rinky dinky dink, skinny my rinky do. I love you. I love your sparkling eyes and I love your bottom nose. I love you from your head right down to your toes. Skinny my rinky dinky dink, skinny my rinky do. I love you just as you are. I love, I love you. I love you, God loves you. Skinny my rinky dinky dink, skinny my rinky do. God loves you. Skinny my rinky dinky dink. Skinny my rinky do, God loves you. He loves your sparkling eyes and he loves your button nose. He loves you from your head right down to your toes. Skinny my rinky dinky dink, skinny my rinky do, God loves you as he does. Jesus died on the cross for us because he loves us. And that's very cool.
Now, if you've got some bubbles at home, you can bring out the bubbles now. Otherwise, you can just sit and listen to the song with your baby, or you can blow some bubbles over them if you have them. We're going to do, I had a little turtle. I had a little turtle, his name was Tiny Tim. I put him in the bathtub to see if he could swim. He drank up all the water and ate up all the soap. And now he's sick in bed with a bubble in his throat. So we're going to do thankful and te aroha and then we'll say ka kite, see you later. And I will see you next term, hopefully in person. But if not, we will see you again online here, just like we are now. But something that we can be thankful for, hmm, what can we be thankful for right now? Hmm. Well, I am thankful for holidays and how that means that we can spend more time with family and friends. So I'm going to thank you for the Easter holidays. Here we go. We're thankful, we're thankful, we like to say we're thankful for hands and feet and food that we eat. Thank you, Lord, for the Easter break and holidays and the time we can spend with loved ones. <laughs> we're going to tea aruha now and then we'll see you later. Te aruha, te